here's really the answer to what you're looking for. Because we know that you meditate, we can feel that you get into that clear place. This is what you want to know. It's important that you put some separation between asking the question and receiving the answer. Because if you sit to receive the answer while the question's all active within you, it won't get through. Because the vibration of the question and the vibration of the answer are such different frequencies. So how do I do that? Ask the question and forget about it? That's a perfect question. Understand that life has caused you to ask the question over and over and over again. The question has been asked. You don't have to go back and double around on it. It's been asked. 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 And it's been asked so well over a course of time that the answer is really well formulated. So now, let the question go and meditate to receive the answer. When you meditate and ideas start dropping into your mind, it's lots of different answers to lots of different things. But remember what we said earlier about the path of least resistance? You see, what most think, and maybe even what you're thinking, you're thinking that if I could get in the receptive mode, then I could get an answer from my inner being that is as direct and forthright as the answer from my parents was. Where they will stand and they will speak clearly and loudly and over and over again <laughs> until I get it. Where your inner being, since you're translating it, you have to get good at translating it. You see, and that takes a little bit of practice. And most aren't very good at it because they haven't yet put separation between the question and the answer. So the whole time that they're listening for the answer, they're all balled up in the question. So they can't really hear it. And then when the impulse comes from the receiving mode of the question rather than from the receiving mode of the answer, ah, haven't said that before. If you're beating the drum of the question, then that's the receiving mode you're in. And all you're going to do is get more answers that help you to identify more clearly that yes, this is indeed a problem. Or yes, this indeed is a question. So you have to put separation between the question and the answer. And then, when it first comes, it might seem off the subject, but you have to just trust it. Because it was loud and clear. 